My name is Ranger Alex. I'm a park ranger here at Big Cypress National Preserve. Here in the freshwater Marl Prairie, we may seem far away from the beaches of sunny Florida. However, if we take a closer look, we can see evidence of our oceanic past. Let's go take a look. Behold, limestone, a sedimentary rock formed at the bottom of an ancient ocean that used to cover the Florida Peninsula. Ancient shelled organisms would leave behind their shells when they died. These shells, made of calcium carbonate, compressed together over millions of years to form the limestone we see today. We can still see ancient fossils in our limestone today, like this one. We refer to our limestone as karst limestone. Karst is a type of terrain formed when rocks chemically erode over time. You may be asking yourself, what is chemical erosion? Chemical erosion occurs in Florida when acidic rainwater dissolves the calcium carbonate found in limestone. The water becomes neutralized by the chemical reaction, which means its pH is 7 and is healthy for plants, animals, and humans. We can watch the chemical erosion process take place right before our eyes by using vinegar due to its high acidity content. Features created by chemical erosion, which are typically found in karst terrain, include solution holes, sinkholes, and aquifers. Solution holes are formed when limestone erodes over time, caused by the mixture or solution of rainfall and acid produced by decaying plant material. Sinkholes in Florida form when water dissolves the limestone underneath soil and creates an underground chasm. Without rock to support it, the soil layer collapses and creates a hole on the surface. An aquifer is a body of porous limestone saturated with groundwater. Groundwater enters an aquifer as precipitation seeps through the soil. It can move through the aquifer and resurface through springs and wells. Limestone aquifers are incredibly important to humans since it's where we get our drinking water from. Without limestone aquifers storing our drinking water and neutralizing the acidity of the water, we would be left out to dry. So next time you take a stroll in Big Cypress, look down at the ground and thank our limestone for all it does for us here in South Florida.